Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Daily Duel. So today is... What the fuck is today? Today... Today is, uh... Saturday? Yeah, today is Saturday. He's using Heraldic. Still, no time for it. Like I said, uh... Wow, you're just gonna quit. Like, all I did was summon Goldfish. Like, really? You didn't even see what the hell I was gonna summon. I just summoned Goldfish. Whatever. We'll go ahead and get another duel in. Be right back. Alright. Hopefully this person won't quit. And that was a good hand, too. That was a really good hand. Like, I was literally gonna go into playing code and rank up right into a giant hand. But no. And now I get a shitty hand. Like, come on. Come on. What is this? Like, why would you quit on my good hand and then give me shitty hands? Like, thanks. Ah. <sighs> anyway, uh, I stayed before this whole week up till, you know, uh, the decision is made on who will be joining me for the tag series. Uh, nah, this hand's not terrible as fuck now, but still, not something I really want to overextend with right now. And phase MST? Go ahead. I don't know what the fuck this is. When this attack is destroyed by battle and sent to the grave, right? While in pit attack, attack, attack. So the damage stuff, destroy the monster that it battled. That's fine. I don't really care about getting destroyed. If you got any traps, go ahead and play them now. Forever hold your peace. So I guess I'll go ahead and just make my uh, boss one. So I guess I'll go ahead and make plain coat. Anyway, uh, since, you know, there's no tag partner using this deck on itself, all of the decks I'm trying to get them to they can at least play by themselves, just in case, you know, because some decks will be, you know, reverting back to not having any tag partners, depending on the day. So I need to make sure that all of them can play well by themselves. And, uh, yeah. So go ahead and make my boss monster. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to attack him. Oh, yeah. You can go ahead and get your effect, I don't care. Oh yeah. Alright, so I'm gonna send you... And I already have Unicorn, so... I guess I'll go ahead and start sending my uh, Amber Calm Of course, you will go off, and I'll go ahead and grab Amphisbina, and... Yeah, I totally didn't mind you not be destroying my shit. Alright, and then of course Unicorn. Bring me back. Beam me up, Scotty. Uh, what is that from? Star Trek? I don't know. I I, I don't watch Star Trek, so... <laughs> sounds, sounds like I think it's Star Trek. What am I saying? Anyway, uh, I'm pretty much done updating every, you guys. There's no more part... It's not part 4 of Return of the d -Long. I'm pretty much done updating you guys, and so this is actually pretty chill. I'm actually just recording a lot, lot, lot right now, so. Goblinburg, that's fine. I'm recording a lot of videos uh, right now. I'm. What have I been doing? I recorded two Vitamin Ys. This is my second daily duel, so two daily duels. I recorded One Finger Death Punch, that new series, uh, uh, Nightmare Tower. King for a Limp. Oh, okay. Detach and grab a uh, mass chameleon, right? The only one who you could really summon right now would be him. Guess he can go for Armadies. That would suck. <laughs> Armadies, this is good. Yeah, mass chameleon. So you can go mass chameleon, summon that back, and army. Unless he has zero D as well. I can't see. No, it's Goblinburg. Oh, Goblinburg does have zero D. Wow, okay. So he can go into rank fours or, or sink eight. Nah. Thanks for the effect. <laughs> I'll send you, and I will send you. You will go off, and I will get... Uh, get you. I'm still sitting golden right now. I'm cool. No.
I mean, of course, dealing with the mass chameleon, that's gonna suck some butt, but besides that, I'm doing pretty fine for myself right now. Of course, I'll activate you, summon you back. I love that play. That's like one of the best plays in this deck, just touching my boss monster. Just touch myself. Ah. Uh. What are you, Earth? Yeah, you're Earth. Do I have any other wins in there? Yeah, I have another Amber Convoy. Okay, then I'll just normal summon you. So yeah, it's just a pretty chill day. Uh, what else did I record? At the point of this video, I haven't recorded the indoor commentary. I hate the indoor commentary. I really do. It is, I don't like that series. I don't. So we'll go ahead and summon Lightning Chidori, of course. Lightning Chidori is going to bounce your monster because I don't trust your monster. So that'll go to the bottom of the deck. I don't care about your back row. Bouncy monster, and then I'll bounce your uh, King of Fur Limp. The suck thing is that he could just summon it again. He can summon it again. He can summon Mask Chameleon, summon that back, make another Mask Chameleon, detach, get another Mask Chameleon. Actually, I could have just ended this duel, couldn't I? I think so. I think I could have just ended this duel. Oh well. Well, it's pretty clear he's going to be killing my uh, Lightning Chidori next turn. Let's see if he does that exact play that I just said. Mask Chameleon, some of that Goblin Bird. Uh, XC into Mask Chameleon, detach, get another Mask Chameleon, and run over my Lightning Chidori. That's what I predict he's going to do this turn. Let's see how wise I am, and how, how far I am ahead of my opponent. Okay, well, I didn't know Charcoal and Punchy. Oh yeah, he does have zero D. Same thing, same thing. Oh god, he has zero D. Make another Mask Chameleon? Actually, Exapon wouldn't be too terrible right now, either. He'd still lose, but wouldn't be a terrible play. He's going to Exaton. I'm up on race like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. No, he's going to Synchro Summon. Okay. I have no responses for any of the plays you're doing. Ha, fuck your foul warning. Mm-hmm. Fuck your limited cards. It's cute. You're cute. Summon you two back. Make a castell, bounce it back to actually after this game. Then I can actually use Twin Evil and equip. That'd be funny. Castell, of course. I mean, Castell's a fucking boss. So, I'll go ahead and just put you back. Just taking it easier today. Still gotta record some Dragon Ball Z League videos. Don't mind recording some of them. What else do I gotta do? Ah, I'm just chill. Just chill. Oh, on well, that duel. Let's get another duel in. We're back. Yeah, um, during the weekdays I actually reduced the amount of videos for uh, Dragon Ball Z League. Ew, this hand's disgusting. I can't do much with this hand right now. If I draw Amphisbina, that's who I need right now is Amphisbina, so I can go discard special, bring it back, and then make my boss monster. Amphisbina, my kingdom for Amphisbina. Light Swords? I'm guessing Light Swords. Ah, that's a background, never mind. Ojamas. No, that's fine. I 
Wow, that was kind of an anticlimactic turn, I must say. Yay! F is Bina. That's exactly who I needed to start going off with my plays. Thank you, FSB. Enough. You showed up at exactly the right time. He's like, ha, huh, hurt my name. What's my name? FSB. FSB was like, HMD. Quitting already. All right. Let's get another duel in. All right. Got another duel in. So, yeah. I reduced the amount of number of tests they can do uh, during the weekdays because, oh my god, like, I should you not. I would be working on test videos for, like, six hours a day. Like, come home from college, six hours a day is just working on the test, and god, it, it was tiring. You want to take the duel? I could take the duel slow, too. I'll just set my MST and my Royal Decree pass to you. And during your end phase next time, I'll flip that Royal Decree, and then I'm going to start playing. Okay, fuck back row. Fuck your back row. I like Royal Decree. Royal Decree is one of my favorite cards in all of Yu-Gi-Oh, because fuck back row. So reveal to me what you're playing. More back row. Alright, I'm tired of this, I'm gonna flip it up. You got that MST? Yes you do. He's like, no, I need my back row. I can't duel you without back row. Yep, there's D prison. Oh dude. Some people just can't play without back row. I stated before. He needs his back row. It's pretty evident that he needs his back row. You can't do it without his back row. You can't do it without his black row. Should I even try to go for it? If I get deeper, I'm gonna be mad. Oh well, fuck it. Bottomless. I already hit one D prison, so I'll probably just run into another one. I mean, D prison is at three. D prison? Shocked! Not really, no. Ah, uh, like I said, my kingdom for a royal decree. Are you actually gonna play me, or are you just gonna freaking sit here and play back rosies? Another D prison? Hippo Carnival. Okay. Sure, I guess. It's starting to run out of resources here. It's starting to get out resourced. And I don't even say sent to the graveyard! Disgusting. He's not really gonna get to draw a car off a goddamn token. Fucking retarded. Just fucking retarded. Off a fucking token, he gets to draw a card. Like, why? Why did they make. Oh my god. Makes me not even want to attack anymore. Makes me not even want to attack. But I have to. I have to play. That's why I hate supply. I hate supply squad so much. I hate supply squad or supply unit or whatever. I hate it. I hate that card. Because it messes with you fucking psychologically. You have to attack. Yet you don't want to attack. And it's just like... I'm hella out of resource right now. Yep. Chronomancy, Astromancy, Pendulum Shokin. Whole bunch of shit. Not eyes, another odd eyes, another odd eyes. Fucking 
4,000 of my damn life points down the drain. Can I activate this? Can I? No, I can't. Is this permanent? Oh, I just lose 600. Tongue so bad, so bad. I just want to go. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Send all I've been drawing is unicorn, so send you and send you. Cops get you. Yeah, so this will come down to one backer he has. Another unicorn, that's all, like I said, that's all I've been drawing, it's fucking unicorn, this entire duel. You. You. Just fuck my life, like, I can just, fuck you, Daniel, you don't get to play Yu-Gi-Oh today. Thanks. Thanks, I didn't want to play Yu-Gi-Oh today anyway, it's cool. Ah, uh, yeah, that's game. Ah, uh, of course it gets this. Of course it's all in the morning. Any other card, it's all in the morning. Of course, of course. Like, am I the only person who's not lucky in the world? I have to be. I have to be the only person who's not lucky in this world. What? I can equip? Why the fuck would I do that? Just cower in fear at the strength of his field right now. Fucking solemn warning. Look, come on! Five to the face. Sorry to God, that's bottomless face down. I'm gonna kill a bitch. Cause I need an exiton stat. He already uses warning, so. Do this, Exiton. Be my hero. I need a. I need a hero. I need an Exiton. I need a hero. Thank God, I can actually come back into this door. Maybe. I don't have to worry about him doing shit. Thank God. That extra ton went off. Oh, yeah. oh wow. 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 Okay. 
Okay. Did he draw into that? You know what? Fuck it. I don't even care. Wow. Wow. Really? 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 Wow. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. All fucking right. Did not see that coming. Really? Whatever. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and call it. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. I will see you guys tomorrow. Still using Klee put. I want to take the deck off. I already have the deck. They're ready to replace it. It's just... Mega Capital G is not messaging. Literally, Mega Capital G is not messaging anybody back. Like, I messaged him. I put comments. People were putting comments like, "Hey, you know, we donated. We gave you ten dollars. We donated. Can we get the, what happened to that guest upload? You know?" And he's not messaging anybody back. So you're just gonna take my ten dollars and not offer me any goods, any goods or services? That's fucked up, Mega Capital G. All right. So I'll see you guys tomorrow with Cleepit. Thanks for watching.